hello guys this is Victor and I'm back with another tutorial on LFL studio and today we are going to be dealing with removing of heavy background noise on F or we using stock plugin called Edison on FL studio Edison can you help you in removing background noise from vocal without you losing any form of quality of this vocal but before then I want you to subscribe to my channel if you sings if you look at my video as a video that is very useful to you and you want to get more from me don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get to get notified anytime I post any new video so before that wasting much time I want us to go into into this this plugin I want to show you which is from third filter noise gate we can use this in removing vocals removing noise from vocal also but in this case we are going to be doing it on a different way because it seems like the editing is more powerful in removing background noise from vocals so without much time I want you to listen to the vocal we have here check the background noise that is on it and let's get to it to see how we could get rid of this noise May nobody talk about our love tonight And I pray say may nobody quench this fire So many things that I wish tonight Now, this is the vocal that we are going to be dealing with and this is the background noise that is giving us some kind of hefty headache that we cannot do without it Actually, I just decided to force this noise into this vocal so that we could do, we could be able to take out this tutorial it was just a radio noise i decided to just turn on and force the noise into it so that we could get something but for you for any for in case you have this kind of problem with your mic or your sound card that generate this kind of noise or your mic is not as quality that generate noise you can use this way to help yourself out for the meantime so let's load up the editing for you to load up an editing on this work you have to click edit sample it's loading now we have it this is the editing I was telling you about editing is a very nice plugin that will help you acquire noise a particular thing that you want to get rid boom you are good to go so without much time I want to acquire one of the things that you need to know after you open the editing you click and then you acquire the noise that particular thing that you want to get rid from need on all of the vocal now I just right click a little bit of it, listen to what I want to get rid of. You can see that is what I want to get rid of in this vocal. So now what I need to do next is to right click on this brush. It's loading. It's trying to acquire the noise. Yeah, noise has been acquired. So now after that, you need to right you need to you need to just you need to like highlight all of the vocal control a to highlight all of the vocal now after highlighting the then you left click on it it's loading now we have this editing clean up the noiser now the editing clean up the noise has been loaded you can see that we have some kind of noise a lot of background noise here that is affecting our vocal that is not giving the quality that we want on our vocal so how do we get rid of it now is how many amount of noise you want to remove how much you want to remove so now you that you check and listen to the kind of noise that you have is that noise too much but for in this case i think this noise is too heavy for us so now i will just add an amount to it like on um, 6.4 or let me get it to like 7 or something or 8 8.3 let me get it here so now after I'm done with it then I press accept listening to what is going to happen just just see what is going to happen it's loading it's denoising yeah you can see immediately the line of the noise here reduce so let me play it for you so that you can see may nobody talk about our love tonight 
And I pray say may nobody quench his fire. So now, in this case, we try to remove some amount of noise and it already decreased the noise on it. So now, the, I don't think it's much that much because we need to remove enough of it from it because it's still disturbing. So now, we still go and then click on to load up the denoiser. Then I add some amount to it again, like uh, let me take it to 10 or 10 to 11 this time around. Then I accept. A minute, please. Okay. Now let's play it. May nobody talk about our love tonight. And I pray say may nobody quench this fire. So many things that I wish tonight. That was a great work. And this Edison is having a great work done here. So that now you can see that we are having a perfect clean vocal already. Using the Edison to remove those noise at the background without affecting our vocal. Now let's add more amount to it and see what we get. At this time, I'm not going to add much so that it won't dry up our vocal too much. So I'll just add like um, 13, 13.4. Then I accept and see. Is the noise in? Good. May nobody talk about our love tonight. And I pray say may nobody quench this fire. So many things that I wish tonight. You can see, this is a very, very nice and perfect jessa that could use, that you can use in removing noise from your vocal. I can remember when I started using FL Studio New, I was using Cubase and I was using FL Studio also, but because of this denoiser, I could not stick to fl to cubase i have to switch to fl studio no matter or no matter all cost and i discovered and i discovered that i was so much in love with fl studio because of this dsr in times of when i was having a bad interface that is not that good so now you could see that we try to acquire all the bad frequency that we do not need in our vocal so what do we do next because the, vo the vocal we have here is totally different from the vocal we have here right now because this one has been treated and this one has not been treated. So one of the things you need to know is to just click here, you hold it on the ground, then you drag it, drag it to the vocal here, and then you let it be. Now, the change has been acquired to this form in our playlist. May nobody talk about our love tonight. And I pray say may nobody quench this fire. You can see a lot has been done there already. And then we already tried to acquire some, some kind of background noise that is not wanted in our vocals. So now, thank you very much if you believe that this tutorial is more, more food to you that you like this tutorial. I want you to subscribe to my channel because a subscription will mean a lot to me and it will give me much energy to be doing this more and more bringing you much information if there's anything that you find it difficult on fl studio that you think you want to let me know you can just put it that right there in the in the comment box and i promise to attend to you as soon as possible so before